The KZN Department of Education is intending to roll out a Go Digital Transformation mobile application with an intention to create a technologically driven administration. This mobile app, of course, seeks to facilitate qualified educators' application process. Of course, tapping into the fourth industrial revolution, this app can be located or found in both stores, which is your iOS, iStore, and Android. Yeah, okay. There we go. You type KZN. There we go. KZN Qualified Educators pops up. Simple because I've already installed the app. I'm going to see on my screen open, you know, because the app is already installed. But in this case, I'm going to open the mobile application. As I open the mobile application, it takes me to the user interface. And the user interface, because I'm going to be a new user, remember, I'm trying to register into the database, into the system. The moment I click register, the system is going to ask me, select a type of a user. We've got two types of users. You've got your principal and you've got an applicant, which is your qualified educator. In this case, I'm selecting an applicant, which is a job applicant. That's you at home. Right now I click register. As I click register, now it requires um, my surname. In this case, creating Cylinder name is Eugene, ID number, I would say 84. No, 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 not necessarily. 84. Okay, all right. Mobile, mobile number 0722806395. Okay, alternative number 0765319631. And email ID. I put the one gene quality designs the password I put one two three four five six seven eight nine zero or well, confirm your password yes one two three four five six seven eight nine zero okay the gender okay of course I'm a male um, the race I'm an African create any disability in this case no do you have any criminal record no any age group this is very important to address your um, to address your your, 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 your your gender equity is a 35 are you a pessary holder if you're a pessary holder in this case I'm saying yes with intention to simulate of course pessary holders if you've got Funza Lushak I've got um, KZN DOE we've got NFSAS create for instance I'd say Funza Lushaka. if it's Funza Lushaka, then I'm creating next oh it says please provide your profile picture okay let me do so Go to the profile picture. In this case, go into a camera in the profile picture. Boom. Use the profile picture. There you go. Please select a preferred district. Oh, very important. A user can select multiple districts. Why is that important? Simply because in the event where we blood notifications. Uh, in a particular district, you're intending to work at Uku district, if should there be any post available in that district, you'll be notified. If you intend to work in a particular district, like for instance, Utungulu, you'll be notified. In this case, I'm selecting Ileme, Pine Town, and Umlazi. Go. There we go. On my academic record, this is a very important part because your academic record determines if you meet the criteria. The event where a principal um, creates job to fill um, module or post this part is very important which year did i matriculate i matriculated in the year 2002 okay 2002 please put in your matrix certificate matrix certificate in this case i go to my document okay i go to my document if i go to my document there we go there is a document there successfully attached or downloaded and then a matrix statement a matrix statement should there be any document that I want to go? Let's say, for instance, camera. I need to see this one. There we go. That's my certified statement. Uh, matrix statement. Okay. Okay, right. I've done the proof. Do you have a diploma? Do you have a degree? Do you have a PGCE? In this case, I have a degree. For which year obtained that particular degree? I obtained it in the year 2006. Okay, which institution? Let's say Rhodes University. 
okay right um a certified copy of your okay attach a copy of the certificate yes i'm attaching it in this case is my copy and use it um your academic record very important you can come into seven eight pages in this case i'm attaching my document document boom done successfully done with that very fast okay you've got a degree pgc owners etc you will fill in there in the event where I select masters deliberately and don't put any information in the system, is going to show me, okay, that it's required. Please provide masters complete information. In this case, I don't want to put it on masters. Okay, I move next. There we go. We move to your subject combination. Very critical. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, your subject combination determines um, if you qualify for that particular post or not. Subject combination, as we all know, Universities, we we major in particular uh, subjects. Okay, uh, we go select a subject combination. Uh, we select a foundation phase from primary, uh, which is from what grade to what grade. I'm prepared to teach grade one to what grade to grade twelve. All right, this is a grade twelve what subject. I'm intending to teach mathematics. Done. Okay, that's your subject combination primary subject. Okay, I've done that secondary subject from one grade. I'm intending to teach from grade one to what grade, okay, to grade 12 as well. Okay, grade 12, what subject? Um, in this case, I'm going to be teaching computer. Done. Right, do you have any secondary second? Just in case, yes, I do. I can also teach from grade one to what grade to grade um, 12. What subject? Life orientation. Full discipline. Okay, done. Now I'm done. Any years of experience? This is not critical, uh, ladies and gentlemen, because obviously you're going to be a new entrant in the event you're a new entrant to the system. If 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 um, you come for the first second time, got experience you can put. In this case, I don't have, so that's not a mandatory field. Okay, are you registering to the app now? Yes, I am. Boom. Registering into the mobile application. Now the system is now registering me into the database. The moment I get into the database, remember, should there be any post coming in, I'm going to receive a notification coming into the system. Your ID number is already registered. Oh, that means I'm already on the system. Not duplicate. Can't forge this. Can't fake it. Now I'm tapping into the principal user control. When the principal logs into the mobile application, what he sees and what is the process? A principal does not register into the mobile application. The district director registers principals that falls under his district or his second manager. That's how it goes. Now, getting to the principal user console or user interface is what you see. Logging on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Logging on into the system, boom, you're inside. As soon as you inside, obviously, we can share the very same news. But in this case, I'm coming to job, create a post, seeing previous post created, a post history, you can log on, check um, all the other uh, recent posts which has created a particular school by the particular principal. In this case, I'm creating, I'm creating to fill a vacancy. What subject? I'm looking for a teacher, a teacher that's going to teach from grade one to grade 12. Um, mathematics okay I'm selecting now what the system will do is it'll go on the database and search those candidates that fits for that particular uh, interview uh, that, that fits for that particular job uh, criteria specialization phase foundation phase number of vacancies that I have to select um, it's immediate and employment con a, a type of employment whether it's a contract uh, permanent in this case I select contract you know ask me okay um, let's provide extra detail um, subject teacher went for maternity leave attachment that you have go to your document be it a leave form you fill in um, that document that is fully edited number of months since it's a contract Go for four months, selecting the reason for replacement um, on leave. Okay. 
Okay, you upload, select, there it is, uh, boom, done. Okay, and a document, contract document. Should there be any document? You select a document, you submit, there it is. We're done.